Hello class, my name is Oka for Gift. Our class for today is going to be on speech phonemes. At the end of this class, you will learn phonemes, consonant phonemes with sample words, vowel phonemes with sample words, digraph and graphemes. What is a phoneme? A phoneme is the smallest unit of speech that can be used to make one word different from another. That is, it has its own distinct sound. Phonemes are represented by letters between slashes, like the letter A for A sound, the letter B for V sound, the letter R for R sound. This is called segmenting in the English language. Segmenting, which means one phoneme to one symbol. There are 44 phonemes in English language, which are 24 consonants and 20 vowels, which includes the short vowels, the long vowels, and the deaf tongues. Example, we have the word phone. When segmented reads or sounds, the letter F, the F sound, the letter U, the U sound, and the letter N, the N sound, that is F-U-N, phone. Consonant phonemes with their sample words. We have the sound bo for bat. We have the sound k for cat. And we have the sound v for dog. We also have vowels phonemes with your sample words which are we have the R uh sound for ant the E uh sound for egg the O uh sound for boat and the E uh sound for fair digraph what is a digraph? Digraphs simply are two letters that represent a single sound. Digraph and graphemes work hand in hand with phonemes in English language. Graphemes. What is grapheme? Graphemes simply is a symbol used to identify a phoneme. Example of graphing used to identify a phoneme. We have the sound A ah for apple. The A ah sound is a phoneme, while apple is a graphing, which means a word. We have the A ah sound. The A ah sound is for elephant. The L sound is a phoneme, while elephant is a grapheme, which, which means a word. You have the O sound for octopus. The O sound is a phoneme, while octopus is a grapheme, which means a word. We have the A sound. The A sound for rain. The A sound is a phoneme. Why rain is a grapheme? Which... So far, we've discussed the phonemes, the consonant phonemes with their sample words, the vowel phonemes with their sample words, how to form graphemes through phonemes, and diagraph. 
this brings us to the end of this class with an exercise number one how many phonemes do we have in english language Number two, you have to identify all the consonant phonemes with their samples. Number three, you have to identify all the vowel phonemes with their samples. Number four, you have to identify and practice all the graphemes of these phonemes below. Number one, the A sound. Number two, the A sound. Number three, the E sound, and number four, the O sound.